this week's edition of The Skinny. I'm Heather Froglier. And I'm Kelly Green. And we're two non-skinny chicks chewing the fat on stories from Nashville to Hollywood. It's brought to you each and every week by Dr. Troy Andreessen in Ontario. So let's get started. We have a new Opry member. Yay! And Darius Rucker has been inducted into the Grand Old Opry. Kind of a cool story. He got invited by Brad Paisley. Yes. He was doing a show this week. They did some questions from the audience. A guy in a white hat stood up. Turned out to be Brad Paisley. He told him, I have two questions for you. One, are you still the worst poker player ever? And two, <laughs> would you like to join the Opry? Of course he said yes. Can you imagine? I think uh, Darius's first three words were wow, wow, wow. <laughs> and then tears flew. And by the way, if you're wondering about that one question that Brad asked him about being a poker player, they play poker together. So I mm -hmm. guess that was a jab at Darius's poker playing skills. <laughs> but congratulations to Darius on being the new newest member of the Opry. The newest member of of the Barrymore Koppelman family yes. is Baby Olive. Aww. Drew Barrymore gave birth just a couple of weeks ago. It was announced this week that she finally had her baby girl, Olive Koppelman. So congratulations. And still waiting to burst is Adele. She's still <laughs> pregnant. <laughs> you did not say that. <laughs> she's pregnant. <Yes. laughs> she's also going to be featured on the soundtrack for the new James Bond film that's coming out. It's called Skyfall. It'll be out in November. She's doing the title track off that. Frogman Scott is the hugest James Bond fan, so I know he's very excited about that. Family Guy creator. Seth MacFarlane is going to be your Oscars host in 2013. I believe the Oscars airs in February. February. Mm -hmm. And Seth MacFarlane, who recently did a Charlie Sheen roast, should be an interesting addition to the hosting duties. Oh, he was great in the roast, so I'm totally looking forward to this. I'm sure he'll have to pull it back a bit. He might. But it'll be great. Somebody who should have pulled it back a little bit this oh. week was Jason Aldean. Yes. He was caught at uh, the Hollywood Club, The Den, mm -hmm. and he was sort of macking on an, a former American Idol contestant, Brittany Kerr. Yes. Kerr. They have pictures of him kissing, hugging, although he says he did leave alone, and right after the incident happened and it went public with all these pictures. He manned up to it and said, you know, I screwed up, I got too drunk, and I let the party go too far. And he's asking for privacy while he works on these issues with his family. And we wish him nothing but the best. That's a really, really hairy situation to be in. Mm -hmm. And, uh, you know, sometimes you just forget you're in Hollywood and there's cell phone cameras everywhere. Yep. So anyway, it is time for our Seriously, Seriously Moment of the Week. <laughs> Girl, I'm about to go off on this story. Go off. Here we go. All right. We, okay. have, we haven't even been a couple of weeks into the American Idol, the new judges panel. Right. Nicki Minaj, Mariah Carey, Keith Urban, Randy Jackson. Mm -hmm. And Nicki Minaj proceeds to go off on Mariah Carey this week. Whatever. Well, you knew it was going to be this. It's the battle of the that's what it's going to come it really down is. to. <laughs> Seriously. <laughs> Nicki Minaj throwing her pink weave around and Mariah Carey <laughs> this week. And TMZ happened to catch the video. There were some quote unquote threats floating around. That's what we're hearing. It's really kind of hard to see if you listen to the video what was going on, but Nicki was upset at apparently Mariah's diva -tude. Well, and the funniest thing is like she is going on full on cussing at Mariah, and in the middle is Keith Urban. He just, just drinking his Coke. Yeah, <laughs> hands in the air, waving him just like he don't care. But anyway, first of all, Nicki Minaj has not been around long enough to have this kind of an attitude. I totally agree. Knew this was coming. Mm -hmm. And girl, you need to get your together because people ain't gonna watch this very long and you're not gonna last very long as a judge if you keep acting this way. Right. People won't want to watch you. They won't. Yeah. Well, Mariah Carey might eat you. So that's it for this week's edition of The Skinny. Brought to you each and every week by Dr. Troy Andreessen in Ontario. Give him a call. 1-800-NEW-LOOK. We'll be back next week with more stories from Nashville to Hollywood and more pink hair flying around. Hopefully not. Bye! Bye.